Hello and good afternoon. Uh, we are actually apparently yes, on a... Yes, it is afternoon. Yes, it is afternoon. Apparently we are on a mission. I have no clue where we're going. She knows. <laughs> yes, I do. Where are we going? I am on a mission. Where are we going? I need two more plants to complete my indoor plant collection. Mm -hmm. So, it's the time of year when all the greenhouses start clearing all their plants. Hopefully. Sometimes. Oh, this is usually about the time of year where they start doing it. Or they have better sales or yes. whatnot. So, I am going to quickly go check out Windmill Garden Center. Okay. Because I know they do have the two plants that I'm looking for. So we'll see what the prices are there. I did find some the other day at Canadian Tire. But I wasn't too happy with them. So I didn't get them. I ended up getting another plant. But not what I was looking for. So we will see what we can find. Also, happy Father's Day to all the guys out there. Yes. So you'll be seeing this later. So happy, probably belated, belated Father's, Father's Day. Day by the time you see it. <laughs> but all the same, happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all the fathers up in heaven. Yep. Dad. Yep. Happy Father's Day to all the fur baby fathers. Yes, that's me. That would be this one here. So, yeah. We will be going to Windmill. So. We're physically in the garden center looking around. We've seen a lot of fresh vegetables that are fully grown, which is weird. Um, Brianna's just over there looking over at some plants. Uh, and then I think we're gonna go over to the entire check that out and see what else we've got. So uh, we'll see you guys in a few minutes and find out what we got. A few moments later. Well, guys, we just finished at the Woodmill Garden Center. I didn't come out with what I wanted. I just came with something. I came out with a basket filler for my front flower pot. And I bought a two foot, I don't know how to explain it, but it, it, it's a really it, it's big, a big you plant. You probably see it behind him a little bit. I'm not can. sure if it's angled yeah. the right way, but it's huge. It's right here. It's a two foot uh, tomato plant that I got for cheap. So for the two things that we bought, it was nine bucks. Yeah. Originally that was for $13.99. I got it for like seven. Something like that. Yeah. So, good deal. And we're gonna put that away in the deck. We're gonna have to repot it because no. I don't think it's gonna <laughs> stay in that pot much longer because it's huge. I had to hold the stem because it was leaning. <laughs> yeah, if you just hold it, it'll fall over. Yeah. So, we're gonna have to find a pot somewhere to we replant have to get a tomato that cage one. too. Probably get a tomato cage because it's massive. Yeah. But it's got tomatoes on it already, so that's good. Yeah. Well, the, it's the it's the um, it's the beef steak beef steak ones tomatoes. So they're the big slicing ones for sandwiches and whatnot. So that's awesome. Um, like I said, I just got one to put in my front flower pot. They did have the one plant I wanted. Well, they had both. But expensive. But I don't want to spend that much because I'm not familiar with them. But the story behind the snake plant that I want, <laughs> my mom had one and after she passed i somehow managed to kill it so i kind of want to get another one to replace that one and grow it for her um as for aloe plant i've always wanted one that really helps. and i know people that have had great success with aloe plants so i want to get one of those so we're gonna head probably to Canadian Tire, I'm thinking. Sorry, guys. Sorry, his plant's going <laughs> everywhere. To see if we can find a new pot. 
and then uh, see what else we find. Yep. So let's go. I'll see you guys there. Just then. Well, guys, we finished checking the entire. Uh, we, then we went over to Walmart. Just the garden center. Just the garden center. That's we all we did. Yeah, pick up we didn't some go dirt. physically into Walmart. Just the garden center. Picked up some dirt. Some dirt. Because they have bags of like a dollar dirt. Yeah. Which, for what we need, that's perfect. And guess what I got? Ooh. I got a snake plant. A Canadian tiger. Snake plant. <laughs> Kind of snake pit. Not a snake pit, a snake plant. Oh, a snake plant. Yes. So I got that. So I had to get a little pot for it. Oh. And we got that. Yep. So I am a very happy girl right now. That just means I have another plant to add to the collection inside. <laughs> I got a lot going. What do you got? Six plants inside? Oh, yeah. well, this will be number six, I yep. think. I think. Yeah, six. Seven. No, six. Well, there could be more because some of my plants are having babies already. Yep. So I have to find the proper way to cut them so that I can replot them so that they don't die. And then, hey, if I start getting lots, I can start selling them if I really need to because people buy them. Yep. So we'll see how that goes. But we're going to stop at Tim Hortons so that we can get uh, some iced coffee because it's rather warm today even though it's not hot like it feels like it's like 30 and it's only 21 yep. so I don't know no idea Hi, can I get two large iced coffees, please? Two large iced coffees? Yes. Anything else? No, that's everything. We'll see you at the window. Thank you. A few moments later. As we were saying, we officially went through Jethro. Yes. Yeah. We're now heading where we're heading to now. Um, <laughs> the car wash. We're going to go to the car wash. It's not your turn to go, buddy, so, but we'll okay. Talk to you guys possibly after the car wash. <laughs> or in the car wash. Or in the car wash. We'll see. So we'll we'll see you. Yeah, we'll see you. No. Like the snake pit? <laughs> no, it's a snake pit. Okay. It's a snake plant. Snake plant. Not pit. Okay. So we'll see you guys at the car wash. <laughs> Well, guys, we just finished at the car wash, as you can tell. I love that thing. <laughs> it's, a, it's a pretty interesting car, car wash, to say the least. I like the fact that it's unlimited, that's a good thing. Well, and like I've said, for me, personally, I clean cars for a living. Yep. By the time I get to doing my own, I don't want to. So, this one does the washing, does the majority of the drying, does my tires, and everything for me. So literally all I'm gonna have to do is like spot dry it and vacuum it and do my inside, which is a lot easier than doing the whole entire thing all the time. And now because we got a new car, I do wanna keep it clean. clean and keep everything looking good. However, <laughs> so mad, so mad. Go out from work, go to my car, get yesterday no thursday in the morning getting ready to go to work look at my card dust is gathered on it so okay looks like i have a ginormous scratch well i get up closer brush it it's not a scratch it's a nice door ding 
you hear her. And it, I've already gone to a couple body shops to have it looked at. It is fixable, but it's probably going to cost me, oh, probably about 150 bucks that I don't particularly want to spend. Nope. And then, and then, I have a nice little rock chip right up in the corner of my windshield on the paint. Not physical glass, but on the paint. So, good thing I work at a Ford dealership and I drive a Ford, so I ordered myself a paint stick so I can actually fix that myself. But literally, I've had this thing for a month and already a door ding. So mad. So. I wish people could respect other people's properties. Yeah. Sorry, that's my rant for the day. I'm done. Anyways, we're going to head home, I think. More than likely, I might drive through Strath Corner really quick. Just because. That, that car still pulled over there. The car that we're driving past, you won't be able to see it, but it was pulled over by like three cop cars the other night. So, yeah, I think we're going to drive through Strath Corner really quick. And then, uh, maybe Police Point, I don't know. We'll see. And then head home. It does look like it's going to rain. Yep. But, I mean, it's looked like that before and nothing's happened. So, don't quote me on it. But, yeah, so we'll see you guys in a bit. Well, guys, we got home about a couple of what, an hour ago. An hour, hour and a half. Hour and a half ago, but we were physically. We didn't, even come, we didn't come in the house. We were just outside doing some garden work. Uh, we garden work, got the grass cut. Yep. Planted got my weeds cut. tomato plant and everything and all that fun stuff. Got all the plants replanted. Just sweating a little bit. It's warm out there. You're like listening. It's warm. No. It's so, wet. I decided I'm going to have my Dr. Pepper. <laughs> I love Dr. Pepper. Yeah, thank you. It's better than Pepsi and Coke. I don't get me wrong, I like those ones too. But sometimes you just the taste, you just need it. So we're gonna relax for a bit and then figure out our supper and then we'll talk to you guys after that. Mm -hmm. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. A little longer than a few minutes later. It's 7 o'clock in the evening. Uh, Miranda's making some Lipton soup for supper and some coffee by the looks of it. Decaf. Ooh, decaf. So I can sleep. I need all the help I can get because someone snores. What are you talking about? I do not snore. Sorry. <laughs> uh, so this evening, I don't know what the heck we're doing. The rest of the evening. Mm hmm. I thought we were Sounds gonna be. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, so, so we'll talk to you guys in a little bit and uh, we'll see where we go after the supper. I just uh, walk away now. Hi guys. 
and now back to your regularly scheduled program. Well guys, we're closing up the vlog for tonight. As you can see, Piper's in the vlog. Thank uh, you. So, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Smash that like button. Right? Mm -hmm. uh, check us out on our Facebook, no, not Facebook, our Instagram, Pinterest, and uh, Twitter. <laughs> check us out on our TikTok. Right there, you got anything else to say? Nope. Nope. Okay, so I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Bye. Bye. <laughs> So, we're going to be making some Lipton soup for supper. And, um... Uh, don't know where to go. Afterwards. You're not in I'm going to edit that out. <laughs> um, I don't know what to say. <laughs> edit. Well, guys, it is. Um, I don't know what I was gonna say now. <laughs> well, guys, we're getting close off the vlog. How? Well, what am I?